welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new and in today's video as you can tell by the title we are going to be doing a reaction video i like to do, the, to do these videos sometimes like over the weekend because i'm interested in new music and why not um so today we are going to be listening to queen nija she just released a single with lil dirk it's called lie to me and this is my girl so i expect nothing but greatness in my ears but yeah so let's just get right into the song i have my friend kamani here with me probably came money so we're gonna be you know just talking right in and enjoying the song so let's just get right into it are you ready i'm ready okay i'm kind of scared because <laughs> you know also i think that like obviously these singles like pack light and now this song lied to me are gonna be part of her upcoming project and oh my gosh i just know her album is gonna be flame like ah oh, i will definitely be reacting so if you guys want to stay tuned for that y'all can subscribe but okay let's get into this song i'm scared <laughs> Is that a sample? Yeah. Is that a sample? Yes, it's I'm at, it's from I'm Mad at You by Tupac. Yes. Which was also sampled in um, Don't Leave Me by Blackstreet. Miss Ma'am. <laughs> Do it! <laughs> Give it to me, baby. Do it! Alright, let's go. Words are called me foolish. Call me stupid. Like, what the hell I'm doing? Yeah. I'm in the studio and focused on my music. Yup, yes, I have. I should put them holes that you've been screwing up. Uh -uh. I can't tell your heart in my nice bed. You will find a gun at the water. No, I got the keys to your heart in my nightstand. Nigga, it's right here. Like, <laughs> and what? Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit, I fell. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Back to the fire. But I'm very happy that she is showing, like, just how she is as, a, as an artist. If, you know, you've been following her through her YouTube all of these years. You know how talented she is and what she can do, and even from her EP. But I feel like she's really stepping into her element of what she really likes and wants to create. And it's so good to see and to hear that. And I feel like when an artist really steps into their element and creates what they want to truly create you hear it in the song like that's what also makes the song good do you get what i'm saying kamani like you almost like hear their passion and their love for yeah. what they're making and i don't know through this it's like you can't bs this fire man like this is flame Back to back, she ain't ghost that she ain't reach it. Oh, I'm romantic because I'm too deep inside the street. Cause you ain't said before my past, but ain't no time in hell. I ain't know about credit. I tried to buy her ass with Obamacare. Hold on, come on, come on. He said, I, I, I come on, he said, ain't no about credit. I tried to buy her ass with Obamacare. I. <laughs> <laughs> I, okay. I just I just wanted to make sure that I heard that right. I just I <laughs> I was like, why well, looking at the lyrics I see Obamacare? Little Dirk. Oh my god. Alright. No no mama though. Low key I'll be texting all her friends. She told me she don't kill I'm sorry. Amazing. amazing. Huh? I said amazing. We said it at the same time. What do you rate this song? <laughs> 10 out of 10. I, it felt like uh, a pure R&B. Does that make sense? Yeah. 
It felt it just very, I don't know, like. I can't get over the sample. Yeah, and how well it went and how well she, oh wow, very good. I feel like people nowadays, like, there are a lot of people like us who do love, like, pure R&B or, like, that sound, but I feel like a lot of people don't appreciate it. So, I'm happy to see her as an artist take that on because she can, she reaches, you know, different people, different age groups and everything. Like, a lot of younger audiences, you know, she does come from YouTube. Um, so, it's like, I don't know, like, they can really appreciate that sound and, like, all, like, I love that. I I love what Queen does with her music. I honestly have been a fan. Like, if you know, you know. But that was amazing. I loved it. I loved it. I mean, little, little dirt's little. All right, yeah. Um, um, but, yeah. So, <laughs> but, yeah, like, I don't know. She just, she brings something different, I think, to the music game now. And... I feel like she's received well, but she isn't at the same time because I feel like she should be more up there because her she's naturally talented and everything, you know, and the music that she makes is obviously good. I just feel like people aren't used to that. I feel like if she were to make something that was more mainstream, people would be like, oh my God, like, you know, Queen Naja is that whatever, but they, you know, like she sticks to what she wants to and I like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. I love it. Wow. Oh, my playlist about to be flame. I already have it, like, done. But I'm just about to add a few more songs. Bryson Tiller and Queen Nyja. And then, boom. Perfection. Wow. Thank you guys so much for watching this Maybe. video. Don't forget to like this video and comment down below. Comment down below what you guys think of the song. And what are your thoughts? And subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. I'm so happy.